Hey everyone, Yen from Devolutions with this week's Remote Desktop Manager Pro Tip. Well, you might be familiar with the website haveibeenpwned.com where you can actually put in a password and it'll list if your password has been recently used in a data breach. So we've incorporated this feature directly in a Remote Desktop Manager. All right, so I'm over in Remote Desktop Manager right now. Now, before I get started, I wanna make sure that I'm logged in as a administrator. Once I'm logged in, I'm gonna to go to the Administration tab, then head on over to System Settings. And then here, we're gonna scroll down to the Password Validation section. There's a couple options here, but the one we wanna check is the Compromise Pwned Password Check here. So right, by default, it is off. So I'm gonna go ahead and enable it and then click OK. Now, anytime I create a password in Remote Desktop Manager, it's gonna do a check to see if my password has been pwned. Now, don't worry, we're not sending your password over to some database to compare to see if it's been breached or not. There's an entire way that we pass the hash over and an API call is made and then the information is sent back. If you wanna know more about that, make sure you read the KB article below. So rest assured, we keep your security a priority. Now, let's see how this pwned password check actually functions. Here I have a username, Ben. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna type a brand new password for Ben. Now built into Remote Desktop Manager is a simple password checker to see how complex a password is. Well, obviously it looks like this password here is not very secure. So I'm gonna click okay. And then notice it says this password has previously appeared in a data breach and should never be used. Obviously we don't recommend you ever use 123456 as a password. So I'm gonna go ahead and click change password. And then I'm gonna use my password generator that's built in and it's following the strong policy. So I'm gonna click generate. And now I got this really complex password I'm gonna put in. Now, once I click okay, there we go. The password has been changed. So that's it. It comes built in with Remote Desktop Manager. You just have to make sure that you enable it. But now you can rest assured that your passwords have not been leaked or used in a recent data breach. Now, for more videos like this, make sure you like and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well as share it on your social media. Thanks again and stay safe.